Hello YouTubers, uh, welcome to Logistics and Analytics Italia. Uh, today's video, it, it, it is not a video tutorial actually, it's just a humble proposition to Microsoft because I have an issue with this button inside the Microsoft Power Query, you know, interface. Basically, I, I've been wandering uh, around, you know, into the YouTube videos in relation to um, Microsoft Power Query and every time that I see the, the, the IT professional, you know, reaching the time to explain to people what this button does and actually how you, and when you have to use it, you know, I feel a kind of embarrassment because actually the close and load button has got two choices, you know, close and load, close and load in. It, it, it is actually difficult to understand what's the difference because the second choice actually it comprises the first one. So that's my proposition. I'd like to have, instead of one button with two choices, I'd like to have in here three buttons. Okay, follow me. Three buttons. Okay, it is load into memory, because I'm not finished, you know, load into memory, and then the second button uh, would be dump into the spreadsheet, because I'm finished and I need the spreadsheet, and save as an external file. So I'd like to have instead of two choices and one button and two choices that it is, it is difficult to understand, three buttons in, in here. Love into mem load into memory because I'm not finished, dump into the spreadsheet because I'm finished, or save as an external file, for example, a CSV file. Why I'm asking this kind of thing? Because I can de depict a situation in which a professional IT, you know, only uses Microsoft Power Query. So he wants basically to start the application right from the Microsoft Office menu. Why do I have to start Excel in order to start from within another application? So why do I have to start Excel in order to start Microsoft Query? You know, Microsoft Power Query, it seems to be a, a very autonomous and in the, in the independent application. So I can depict a situation in which actually a professional IT only uses Microsoft Power Query, you know, every single day. For example, because as a job, uh, he needs to, to develop or mani manipulate external data sources. So I don't understand why do I have to start Microsoft Query from within uh, Microsoft Excel and why do, we, uh, do I have two choices that it difficult, even difficult to explain to people why there are two choices? Because the second one comprises the first one. So I'd like to have, for example, here a different sector inside the, the bar in which there are three buttons, load into memory, dump into the spreadsheet and save as, a, as an external file. This is my proposition. I don't, I don't know if you agree or not anyhow if you watched thank you for watching you know this video and if if you are an english speaker you know guy uh, you are thinking you know this italian guy is quite nice i'm gonna check out his channel actually you can't because my channel is in italian so it would be pointless anyhow anyhow thank you for watching this video to the next video of logistics and analytics italian bye